My name is Dr. Shinalo Animalo, and I am an infectious disease specialist out of Methodist University Hospital and a professor of medicine, Division of Infectious Diseases at UT College of Medicine. Yes. We call it opportunistic infections. So okay. they take opportunity of the fact that your body is not healthy, your body is no longer able to fight, and that's what kills. What we see in the hospital will be somebody that perhaps body is no longer able to fight, and that's what kills. Because I always say, it seems like COVID attack people that already are too weak, their bodies for whatever reason, immune system is too weak to fight it, and it sort of kind of take you down. And uh, so speaking of that, um, I'm so happy I have an expert with me today. <laughs> so speaking of that, what is COVID um, looking like coming this year? Because I hear it's on the rise, not as it was, of course, thank God. Mm -hmm. But, uh, and you all, what, what's it say? I think you said a little while ago, people perish or whatever for the lack, lack of, of knowledge. Of knowledge. <laughs> okay, so give us a little bit of knowledge uh, about uh, what we can expect from COVID this time around. So it's on the rise, like you rightly said, and we are going into the cold, mm -hmm. you know, days and the cold months. So usually you're going to see all those viruses, you know, begin to come up again, not just COVID, um, you know, influenza, flu, you know, mm -hmm. AMB, RSV, respiratory syncytial viruses. So these are the viruses we're all going to see, um, <laughs> you know, this period, you know, especially in the winter area. So COVID, as you can imagine, was not, it's not as bad as it was you know nine you know 20 19 20 20 it was uh, beyond devastating so now you know all we're saying is you know to ask people to be you know get your covid vaccine be optimated you know um get your booster vaccines and you know um try and use protective measures if you are in you know let's say in a crowded area because it's coming back mm. you know it's just one uh disease i'm sort of tired of I guess because unlike say HIV or whatever if you're not sexually active or whatever there's you know but I mean you have to breathe right of course and you have to live so you sort of get tired of that one because it you can't point your finger at somebody and say well you're this or you're that the reason you have this right my name is Dr. Shinalo Animalo and I am an infectious disease specialist out of Methodist University Hospital and a professor of medicine, Division of Infectious Diseases at UT College of Medicine.